and loving Heavenly Father. We thank you for this day. Lord, we're celebrating Men's Day. Lord, we ask that you just lift up men today. Draw them closer to you, Lord. Father, we know that they are an important part of what happens in your ministry. Lord, we want strong men. Men who believe and fear you. Men who trust you in all their ways, Lord. Lord, we just ask that you raise some men who will come and lead people to find Jesus Christ in the pardon of their sins. Lord, this is a special day that we're celebrating. And Lord, I ask that you bless everyone here. Bless their families. Bless their loved ones. And Lord, we just ask that you just have your hand on them for good. And move today in a mighty way as we lift up the name of Jesus and give praise, honor, and glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our scripture is going to come from Jeremiah 33 and verse 3. It says, Call unto me, and I will answer thee, and show you great and mighty things which thou knowest not. The word of God. Amen. Another day's journey. How are you glad about that? 
I'll check one, two, three, four, five. Check one, two, three. Check one, two, three. I get a little light, please. Sir. Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Please excuse us as we reach back to back to the old backwood church. Now, all that I want to engage, you right where you are sitting down. But like our pastor said last week, don't sit down on your brains. Turn your neighbor and say, don't sit down on your brains.
Martin McKinley. I'm the senior pastor here at the Massachusetts Baptist Church. My bride, our leading lady, Sister Justine McKinley. Macedonia, if you don't mind, I'm going to ask you to stand. Let them see you, Macedonia. Let them see you, the Macedonia Baptist Church. We certainly hope and believe that you've been blessed already. And the only thing we can tell you is there is more good stuff to come. We believe that God has a word with your name on it that is specially prepared for you. He knew you were going to be here. He prepared a word to be delivered into this house for your situation. And if you are right on time to get your blessing today. So we want to say thank you again. If it is your first time, please don't make it your last time. If it's been a long time, don't make it so long the next time. Just come on back and join in as we worship and praise the Lord and lift up the name of Jesus. Pastor Dunn, at this time, would you please stand, greet our guests, and greet one another.
and as we make our way back to our seats, we're going to go ahead and, and have our announcements for the week, and then we got some special stuff we need to get done, uh, announcements for the week, but none other than Brother Tori Jones.